doing? Oh, that one sucks. <sighs> so nice. bad. Oh, man. We're moving on to a super special portion of the live stream. <laughs> Taco Bell hot sauce. Right. El Yucateco, Brother Brew Brews, Blair's Beyond Death sauce, The Elixir. Flash's Extreme Handcrafted Ghost Pepper Sauce, uh, Satan's oh. Blood, Da Bomb, Beyond Insanity, oh. The Last Dab, right, The Egg, right, Rob Ones! <laughs> Woo! All right, everybody, welcome to Rob Ones. It's the show with hot questions and even hotter wings. <laughs> <laughs> I have compiled questions from some of Rob's friends and oh, really? myself and some very strange <laughs> questions from Rob's mother. And <laughs> we are going to be uh, eating hot wings and then answering or asking Rob these questions. Awesome. I don't think anyone's ever done this format. <laughs> Our first sauce of Rob One's today is Taco Bell hot sauce. All right. All right. It is a Scoville unit of 500 Scovilles. <laughs> Cheers all. Cheers. Cheers. Mm, that's T-Bell right there. Delicious. Mm -hmm. These first two questions are from Jeff Linville. Oh, awesome. Were there any projects you were really excited about that didn't pan out? <laughs> I mean, there's a lot, I, but they usually don't make it to the internet. There was one that I was really excited about that definitely didn't pan out. And I later realized that it just wasn't a good idea. But in 2016, I attempted to bring music back to MTV. <laughs> and I made a TV pilot with MTV. And then we got like a rough cut. And it was just very clear that like, this, this isn't gonna work. <laughs> like, it was great filming with them. Like the team that I was with was really great. I flew out to New York. It was kind of try to take what I was doing on YouTube. And originally it was me and Andrew were gonna be the hosts. And then later it was me and Sarah Longfield. And it was gonna be trying to put what we were doing into a half hour format. And then it was going to be on MTV. And the marketing material that we were planning um, with MTV was like, music's coming back to MTV. It just never worked out. Am I allowed to say that? I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say that. Live well, streaming. Too bad. Here we go. <laughs> What's your favorite video game? <laughs> oh, Jeff already knows this. <laughs> I have two answers. For of all time, if nostalgia plays a factor, Spyro 2, without a doubt. Spyro 2, Ripto's Rage, all day. I played it, uh, we got a PlayStation as a kid. I played it like crazy. Like I would, I had multiple memory cards that were full with 100% the amount of times that I've played that game or like watched videos about that game is like ridiculous. Games that came out in the last 10 years, definitely play deads inside. <laughs> like anyone who comes over and like stays with us, it's like a must, they have to play it through. I've watched people play through it a million times. If you haven't played play deads inside, don't search anything about it. No, no. Major spoilers. Yeah. I played just, through the entirety here because yeah. he made me. Yeah. <laughs> and because it's awesome. Yeah, and because it's awesome. I don't actually make people play it, but. A little bit. It, you do, you do. Maybe actually. a little, maybe a little. You, okay, have, I actually, you absolutely make you people absolutely play You absolutely have to, or yeah. we're opening the door and kicking you out and you're not saying what All right, the second sauce is El Yucateco, and it is 9,000 Scovilles. Yeah, because there was no spice in that other one. No, not at all. Hit it up and then we will hear a question So I just have one bite then, I guess. Rob Rucha. Oh, I don't know. I guess the thing That's is, you just take one dump. one big bite. Oh, there's some spice on here. Yeah. Oh yeah, mm. it's good though. Rob Rucha asks, mm -hmm. "What is the biggest mess you've made in Uptown Recording?" <laughs> the Jazz Day, without a doubt. <laughs> we use breakaway bottles. There's different ways that you could make them. Like old Hollywood, they were sugar, but these are just a certain type of plastic, and they break and look like glass, but they're harmless. When we broke them, they they go into a bajillion pieces. And oh man, I'm already feeling it. Yeah, oh, yeah, that was I'm that, already really. That was spicier it. than I thought it was gonna be. Oh, this is gonna be painful. Oh yeah, dude, this is gonna get bad. This is gonna be terrible. This yeah. is gonna be really bad. What have we done? You can go there now, and if you look, you're still gonna find shards of green glass. And not even shards, but like like little dusty yeah. particles. Those went uh -huh. everywhere, and he's he's been finding it ever since. Yeah, it, yeah, it that comes was up every time. <laughs> yeah, Rob puts up. Uh, with a lot when, when we go there. Third sauce. Yeah. Brother Brew Brews, African hot pepper sauce. Yum. There is mm -hmm. no specific Scoville on it, but they estimate it is between 50,000 Scovilles and 250,000 Scovilles. And I've had this one before. I don't think there's gonna be much spice to this one. And yeah, then there's a couple great. questions from me. Okay. Oh yeah, this is less spicy than El Yucatan. Rob, you've had a yeah. lot of jobs pre-YouTube. <laughs> yeah. Which is harder, working in a library or shooting wedding videos? Ooh, they're so different. Like filming weddings 
was more stressful, I think, but everything I was doing, I was more confident in. Yeah. Where with the library, I worked in digital services, and so I would like make tech classes. I think the library was, was more challenging. Okay. Because I was doing different stuff all the time. Really quick, the shiny Hunter Viper Super Chat just bought the program now, Rob. Glad to yes. be able to support you. Keep up the good work from retired UK university students. Awesome. Can't believe you're still up, dude. Yeah, I can't believe <laughs> right? you're still up. Uh, okay. I hope you have fun with the class. Fourth sauce is Blair's Beyond Death Sauce. This one is quoted at, by the internet at 100,000 Scobills. I think this one's gonna be high. Yeah. Careful. You do one bite? I'm gonna go with the guest. Oh man. Oh no. Careful with your lips. Whoa, yeah, that's <laughs> spicier. That's definitely hotter. This is a question wow. from Tamara. If you had the same reach, impact, and finances that you have as a guitar player, as a rollerblader, would you choose <laughs> rollerblading instead? <laughs> no, but it would be hard to say no to, because I love rollerblading so much. I wish that I had, and that, oh my god! <laughs> that was bad! I would still choose music, but I would wish that I could choose both. Oh, wow! That's awful. This is terrible. Oh, oh no. Yeah, this is awful. Oh no! I wish that I had an unlimited amount of time and I could do both. <laughs> this oh, is the yeah, one that yeah. I told you was going to be crazier than... Yeah, where we put it? Oh god. Dima Flagman Super Chat says celery. Oh. Have some celery. Let's do it. I'm gonna try to go no milk for as long as I can. I would love to teach skating, have a skate team in Chicago, build a skate park, do all that stuff if I had just unlimited resources and time. Sauce five, Hellfire, the elixir. This one is quoted on the internet as non-specific, but anywhere between 250,000 and 1 million. That's a really big gap. Yep. All right, cheers. Oh gosh. Oh, I'm sure I got a good big bite of it. All right, I'm feeling a bit better. Yep. This one's not nearly as spicy. No. We have a segment here on uh, Rob One's called Explain That Graham, where we take uh, interesting, interesting <laughs> or uh, questionable <laughs> <laughs> photos or videos from a <laughs> subject Instagram and get more information. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So that is me at Arlene's Grocery in New York. And me and Sarah on, are on stage. I'm playing slap guitar. And that was part of something we were filming for the MTV show where Sarah and I were having like a guitar battle. I did slap guitar and then she sh did crazy shred. And then she inevitably won. <laughs> uh, it was great to film. It never got edited though, so that, that was part, that was in the MTV pilot. Next long film day, see you Monday. Oh yeah, yeah, that what was uh, one of the first videos uh, we shot once I, once I hired you full time. Jekyll and Hyde. Oh, was that? Yeah, that's that, makeup on your face, yeah, that yeah, that, okay. that's Yeah, I took off the um, all the prosthetics. And that's everything that was left. I didn't know what that was, so I just wanted oh, really? to know. No, you were, you were there. Last one. Oh, that's uh, me and my friend Brian. Brian, the world's fastest clapper. One, two, three, four. <laughs> or used to be the world's fastest clapper. That's from, uh, I was, right when I went full time, I decided, like, I got all this time to make videos. Why not do the most demanding video schedule ever? Um, and was doing, like, daily vlogs. What was it? Unnecessary stop motion with Brian. <laughs> With Brian. He looks so sad. Yeah, I look terrible. <laughs> no, but like mournful sad. Okay. Saw six. I had this one. I still think it's not as bad as that that fourth one we had. Okay, so this is Elijah's Extreme Handcrafted Ghost Pepper Sauce. It is quoted by the internet as <laughs> by the internet. Four hundred fifty thousand. <laughs> All right. I see why they only do like one bite. Because like even if these weren't spicy, this is a lot of food. Are you guys like lightheaded from breathing? Just a little so much? bit. A little bit. I get lightheaded from taking so many breaths. Oh really? Just take as many not, bites not as Rob, much. or you don't even have to take as many bites as Rob does. Just go for it, Rob. All right, cheers. Cheers. Well, I'm just doing one bite. Mm. Okay. That one's tasty. This one's won a ton of awards. I bought it off of Instagram. Mm. <laughs> so you know those awards are legitimate. <laughs> the internet this question memorized. is from Andrew Huang. How no, much do you like... love me, Rob? <laughs> 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 he wrote it in all caps, so. <laughs> How'd be up? A tremendous amount, Andrew. I love you a whole lot. I wish I got to see you more. All right, sauce seven. <laughs> the, amount, the amount that Rob talks about Andrew, Andrew. Wong. Yep. 
He's a- is amazing. <laughs> Rob loves Andy. There, every day I, I get up and I just I'm like oh, I didn't see Andrew today, and then I cry for hours. And then- <laughs> Uh, but but yeah, no, I, I love Andrew a lot. The entire rest of the questions come in four sections of two, and they are all weird questions from Rob's mom. <laughs> oh no. This is uh, Satan's oh. blood. It this is, one sucks. It is 800,000 Scovilles. But it's just an extract. You're not supposed to eat it directly. It's just yep. for food additives. Are you serious? Yep. <laughs> Why are we doing this? I just saw it when I was putting it on. So only have a nibble, guys. It's really not... Oh, cool? it's on this side. Okay. Yeah. Oh, and it's wet. Oh my God. Just have a nibble. Just, Just a, a nibble. nibble. Okay. Sorry. My lips are burning. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Cheers. Oh, that wasn't a nibble. Oh, it's already too much. Oh, it wasn't oh. a nibble at all. That's awful. Oh, it tastes like I'm going to get some of the non-salt, uh, non-sauce side. Oh, it's not even hot. It just tastes like you're not supposed no, to No, it's hot. It. Yeah, it's hot. Oh, man. Okay. Oh yeah, that one sucks. Oh, it's uh, gross. So first question from Terry. When is your first memory of playing a guitar? Oh, that's a great question. Ugh. Yeah, that's hot, I like. Oh man. There was a little while that we got a guitar from someone else. It was a, it was a Fender Squire and it, it was just broken. It was like someone wasn't using it and they gave it to us. Well, then we later got rid of it because it was just broken and it was hanging on the wall for a little while. So I think my earliest memory was having a broken Fender Squire. Oh, that's it's awful. Oh, yeah, it's bad. A broken Fender Squire, and it only had one string on it. And looking back now, I, I now know that the bridge was broken. <laughs> you, couldn't, you couldn't use the fretboard. Um, and I remember like trying to get that string to make any noise, but it was just totally broken. I must have been like seven or eight. Growing up in Arlington Heights, Somewhere on did you ever have the opportunity to dig to China? How was <laughs> it when you got there? Uh, no, but we did. me and my brother dug a really big hole in the backyard just, <laughs> just for fun when we were little kids. We never got to China. All right, moving on to sauce eight. Oh, well, hold on, I'm still trying to open this. Oh, oh this is terrible. I, I think in my, it's, I'm just going to crying a lot. This is what I'm learning. Awful. Bad, this is gonna get worse guys, cause a sauce eight is the bomb. Beyond insanity. Oh, no. Awful. Ready for the bomb? Uh, I feel like they have more time in between them. Oh, I had way too much of that last one. That's bad. Oh, awful. that's really it bad. It tastes awful. <laughs> my eyes are watering now yeah, too. I'm just crying. Every my, every time I breathe, it feels worse. Yeah, the breathing is not good. <laughs> okay, I was trying to try to do it. Where's my Where's my chocolate milk? There it is. I can't do it. Mm-hmm. The milk is really helpful. Thank you for getting that. <laughs> so much helpful. So much. Helpful. So much helpful. <laughs> I can't even say sentences right now. I eat a lot of spicy things on my streams, and but never in a row like this. Yeah. Voice Nuevos says, Ugh. we know you love us. You don't have to cry. We're not going anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. This is De Bomb. De Bomb Beyond Insanity. So this is how many Scovilles? This is 1.5 million Scovilles. Okay, and the last one was 800,000. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I might not go for There's a big lot in mine right here. Oh, you guys. I had De Bomb last time. I grabbed the wrong one. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you I, know? All right. Go I, ahead. I, I, Oh no, you guys, I'm dying. I was dying and then I died, now I'm dead. Next question from Terry. That was not good. Oh, do we eat? What is the first venue you played? If you would count it, El Rey Music in Arlington Heights. That's the first show I ever played. I would consider, they had a venue, they had a stage. There was a music shop in Arlington Heights. I think they're now on uh, Northwest Highway, or just off Northwest Highway. Either way, that was the first place that I played, El Rey Music. That's also where I bought my first electric guitar, the tradition. So shout out to El Rey Music. I think I've shouted them out in a few videos, like, or they've been, we put that name into a few videos before. What about the time the battery went dead in the car? The battery went dead in the car? Oh yeah. I was playing with Grass Mask Catalog in like the dead of winter, uh, somewhere in Grays Lake, um, somewhere near Grays Lake Skate Park, everyone knows where that is, well below freezing. And the battery in the car died. And so I was outside of the venue, just with my drums in the back of the car, just stuck there. And then uh, I think my mom came out and got me. That's probably why she added it. Thanks, what is Mom. your favorite venue and do you prefer playing live? My main interests are in video. Like I got into doing this to make music videos. Um, and so live performance is something that I've been really, really fortunate to do. And I love it, especially with Angry the Perfect Strangers. Um, but v- video is definitely what I would rather do. Um, I couldn't be a touring musician. I think out of the tours, I'm gonna say out of the tours, um, Union Station in Philadelphia is amazing. Is that, was I right? I don't know, man, in Chicago. I've always loved the Metro. The Metro is just fun. Um, 
Yeah, playing awesome the Metro is really too. cool. Yeah, that, that was, was an awesome show that I went to there. John Prince, yeah. uh, Super Chat says, will Rick Riston make another appearance at some point in your projections? Hey, good news yeah. for anybody who yeah. who checks out Guitar Quest. Do I look like I need a coffee? Am I the kind of guy that needs a coffee, bro? Yeah, yeah. Wait, and what, that's, what, that's, what is Guitar that's Quest? completely out, right? Oh, yeah, it is, is out. Is the link in the description? It is in the description. <laughs> the new Guitar Quest, if you're a fan of Rick Riston, he makes an appearance. Unfortunately, we had to work with him in one of the chapters. Because he's the worst. Oh man, it's terrible. <laughs> Mary Spender says, I'm watching the live stream, just tuned in. What the f are you guys doing? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mary. Mary. Having a good time. Mary, help. Help, Mary. Second to oh, last sauce. God. It is the last sauce on the Hot Ones table. The last dab. It is two million Scoville units. It is our ninth sauce, not our tenth sauce. Cheers. Last dab. My stomach is so mad at me right now. Ugh. That at least is flavorful. Yeah, that's least. Yeah. What is your favorite chord progression and how many acronyms <laughs> can you create for this? <laughs> how many what? Acronyms. For the chord progression? Yeah. Uh, I think my favorite chord progression, G major, G major seventh, C major seventh, G. Um, so G, G seven, C, G. Good guitars, cool guitars. <laughs> and throw a seven in there. I don't know, I don't. Uh, last one. <sighs> Guys, this one is called right, The, the End. Uh, the last this tab was flavorful. This one sucks. This one sucks more than any of the other. This no, one I mean, is really six on million Scoville units. It is three times as hot as the last dab. It's so bad. It's really bad. Okay. I've had it before. It's terrible. The cheers. last dab. Yeah, cheers. And you know what, guys? It's a tradition around here to put oh, a little God. last dab on the wing. Right. Uh, I'm just kidding. I'm <laughs> kidding. Okay. Yeah, actually, you're right. It's already three times as bad. Cheers. Okay, cheers. cheers Good everyone. luck. Uh, I didn't get quite as much. I'll take a lot of the little new. Oh, I got so much. Me too. Oh, God. It tastes awful. Oh, that was a bad idea. Oh, I should have just pretended like I got a bunch of it. Oh, oh so that's terrible. That's bad. It's awful. That's a bad time. Last well, question from time. Terry. Oh, it's awful. Kids are kids, but where did you get that scar on your forehead? <laughs> oh, yeah, I got a scar uh, right here. It's kind of hard to see. It's like it's like right there. Um, I was running down the stairs <sighs> as a kid, and I would run down the stairs often. There's a big beam there, and I guess I grew a lot that year because I smacked my head on it and just like put a big cut in my head, and bleeding everywhere. Got stitches on my head. Wasn't a fun time. It was about as fun as this is. Oh, that's bad. It's, yeah, that's oh, it's, it's getting worse. It's getting worse, yeah. Oh, it's getting worse now. I just really needed to get down the stairs, I guess. Oh, I hate oh. that so much. Oh, my. Ah. All right, Rob. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> ten, fling, ten wings yeah. up, ten wings down. Nothing left to do but roll up the red carpet for you. <laughs> this camera. This, this camera, camera and this camera. Tell the good people what you have going on in your life. Oh my God, it's getting worse. <laughs> okay. Your life? Uh, yeah, my life is getting worse. <laughs> uh, well, I have Guitar Quest, which is my brand new guitar course. Ah, uh, the link in the description. It's if you've never held a guitar before, we get you playing a song in the first hour, you, and you're playing with a full band front to back, and then we start with your writing your own music. And then we move on to all the bases of guitar and a mission based structure and it's super, super fun. It's way worse. Yeah, it's, so it's worse. It's such a good time. <laughs> and uh, we're just really, really proud of the course. We're excited to get a lot of people to play the instrument here and, and just get past all what people think of the bases of guitar being boring. We just cut that out. It's a super, super fun time. I'm dying. Oh, that one sucks. That's so so bad. Oh, man. Oh, I'm so lightheaded. Oh. I'm like sweating. Yeah. <gasps> Did Rock sweat the letter C through his shirt? Yeah. <laughs> it does kind of look like that, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> That's us. <sighs> that last one, I told you, that last one's terrible. It's really bad. Rob, your eyes are so red. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm learning that that's where this mega spice goes. I just cry a lot. I didn't touch my eyes or anything. They're just really fucking watery. <gasps> also, just so emotional about Guitar Quest finally being out. Mm -hmm. You're emotional about how the link is in the description. Yeah, right? it's it's mainly just that the link <laughs> is in the description that really that really just makes me tear up. I'm so proud of the link specifically being in the description. I just joined in 
Rob is suffering. <laughs> Star Quest is out now. Hey, dude, how's it going? <laughs> it's going bad. It's still getting hotter. It's going bad. Yeah, it's getting worse. It's still getting hotter. I did not think making a guitar course would hurt this much. <laughs> I'm gonna fly your wings out. I don't know what you want anymore. No, I'm good. <laughs> I am good.